welcome back to my channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel so you can get um, get to all my get so you can get alerted when I make new videos and post new stuff, whatever. So please don't forget to like and subscribe and share. Um, so as you can see by the title of this, um, you can tell by the title. I'm gonna talk about something I experienced with my son. Hey, but no thing. Um, this this weekend on Saturday night. Um. Okay. So it was Saturday night, and me and my baby were at my apartment. We were gonna come to my sister's house here. This is where I'm at right now. At my sister's house. Hold on. I had the day off, so I'm here. Oh yeah. Um, I had the day off because it's President's Day in the. Wait, is it President's Day or no? Yeah. <laughs> okay, because it's President's Day, and you know I'm a president, so I had to take a day off. No, just kidding. So, anyways, yeah, I'm here visiting my sister. Someone from Vacaville is calling me. Me? Someone from Vacaville. I don't know. Me. Oh. Um. Anyways, so. Oh yeah. Sorry. So, okay, it was Saturday night. Um, me and my baby were getting ready to come here to my sister's house because we're going to come help her with the baby. And whatever, my son was on top of the door waiting for, like, waiting for me to come out, whatever. And I was like, wait, hold on, let me put on my shoes. He's like, okay, come on, let's go, let's go. And then he coughed, and I was like, all right, you know, whatever, he coughed. I don't know why, but he coughed. Well, I still remember his cough, that he had coughed. Y que el señor se my sala, I have white curtains so you can see shadows and i remember that he had coughed and that person said the tubo he like that per that person said the tubo and was like standing by my window and i don't know so i was like no it could be one of my neighbors right i don't know why he stopped and i was just probably a neighbor but it was so different this was different because the person walked by twice i didn't see what he looked like i didn't see i wasn't paying attention i'm because i'm like my parents are gated i wouldn't think and he was gonna come in here and do anything dumb. Like my neighbors already know me. My, we know each other. Like no one's gonna do anything to us. But it was so weird because, he, like I said, like he had walked twice really like fast. Not fast. But I mean like walked. I, mean, I didn't get it. I I couldn't even glance look at him. Or I just saw a shadow. So I was like whatever. Um, the baby was like, come on, let's go, let's go. I'm like, okay, fine. Put on my shoes and we walk out. And this is so weird. I don't know if you, if you guys are like me, but like I when I feel like I'm in danger or I feel like. Um, something's wrong. I feel it in me. Like I, I feel something. I, I don't know. What, I don't know what it is, but I felt something. So it was like, like a bad instinct, like. yeah, like a bad instinct, like a um, bad um, something, um, mal sentimiento or something. So I got, I got my baby by his hand, and I was like, come on. And he knew too, like something was up, something was up because he he squeezed onto my hand and he actually got onto my hand. So I got my baby and I walked back. I was looking back. I didn't see anything. I was like, okay, we're good. But I just I'm still grabbing him. I was still grabbing him by his hand. And my parking spot is like towards the back and it's like really dark. So um, I was still grabbing him by his hand. And next thing you know, okay, I got, we got in the car and I was going to turn the car on. And next thing you know, this guy was knocking on my window to open my car. So and I was like, what the fuck? Like, I was like, what the fuck? I, was, I, I didn't want to open my window. I was just like, what the fuck? And obviously you can hear me because I had my sunroof thing open a little bit. I'm like, what the fuck? And he kept trying opening. He's like, open it, open it. I was like, no, I'm not gonna. I'm like, what the fuck do you want? I was like, no. And I was so scared because my baby, like, he was so scared. Like he, oh my god, guys, I'm start crying because it was so scary. Like what we what what, what we went through, like what we experienced. It was so scary because my baby started crying. He's like, mom, mom, like, he's like, what is he doing? Like, what, like, what are we gonna do, mom? What are you doing? I was like, I don't know who he is, my baby. I don't know. I don't know who he is. And he's like, he's like, he's like, what? Tell him, leave. I'm like, I, I am telling him. I was like, my, leave the fuck alone. I was like, get the fuck out of here, man. Like, what the fuck do you want? And my baby was back there crying, like really crying, so scared. I've never seen my son cry. And like, we, we know us personally. My son's like a really brave kid. Like, it is bien So he's like, nothing scares him. Like, nothing. So he was like really, really crying. He was like, "Mom, mom," and I was trying to cuss at this guy out. I just, I wasn't thinking right. Like I, I don't know what the hell to do at the moment. I was just like so like shocked and I was crying. And, like at this point, I was like, "Fuck!" Like this is the end. Like this is it. Right? They're gonna he's gonna hurt me. And my son. Like, he's gonna end up like killing us. He's gonna, like wait, what are you kidnap my kid? Like my dad. What my kid just stays here? Like or if something happens to one of us, my like, like what the fuck? And nobody came out. Was, like. Nobody came out to help us as much as I was yelling. Like nobody came out. Like 
and which is so weird because I it, I was being so loud like and I was honking uh, I was cussing him out and nobody came out to help us and I was like are you fucking serious my, like that's it my, and it was dark like the lights of the parking lot wasn't on so like um, it was even more scarier that I was like nobody is, nobody's looking at us like nobody's like worried about it nobody's looking outside so my god guys like that was like the scariest thing and so the guy's still trying to open my door and i was like okay i'm gonna call 911 i called 911 and i hung up i was like i don't know if you guys know but if you call 911 and you hang up like they get there quick because they're like oh you know that person must really need help so that's what i did i called 911 and i hung up quick and then um then that, whatever I hung up and he was still there and I was like try, and I was like I'm gonna FaceTime my brother I know he's up so I FaceTime my brother so he can be so he can know what's going on and he can someone knows what this person looks like and so or something wants to happen to me and my baby like someone knew someone saw something you know so I was like I'm gonna FaceTime my brother my brother was like what's going on and I couldn't even talk I was just like in shock he's like what happened what happened like my phone kept cutting off and I was like fuck so I called him again and then he was like, What's going on? I was like, Look, do you hear this guy? And he was like, Yeah, I was like, What's going on? I was like, This guy's like trying to get me my baby. I'm like, I don't know what the fuck he's doing. I mean, he has a mask on, he has a want this, he wants a, a like a little baby blanket. I was like, I don't know what the fuck he wants from us. So whatever he's uh, like, he's like, you call I'm like, Yeah, I did. He goes, Okay, he's like, I'm gonna call police too, whatever. My brother's still on the phone, and um the guy was still right there. Um and then okay, so and then he had moved a little bit. Like, he had moved. So I was like, okay, it's my time to back up. So I backed up quick. And I drove up forward. And then he goes again in front of my car. And he was like, um, he was in front of my car. And he had, like, made me stop. And he was just, like, right there. And no se quitaba. And I was like, what the fuck are you doing? I kept yelling. I'm like, what the fuck do you want? And my baby's in the backseat crying. I was like, fuck, my, my baby's fucking scared. I'm like, this idiot doesn't know that my son has, like, well, he doesn't know, obviously. Bless you. Obviously, he doesn't know, like, my son, if you guys know me in personal, if you guys know me personally, you guys know that my son suffers from epilepsy um, seizures. So like this, like this fool doesn't, this guy doesn't understand that he's scaring my son. And I'm like, no hell no. Like my baby's only five years old. He can live his whole life. He has a whole life ahead of him. Like you want to give it to me and hurt me? That's why I'm like, but not my baby. So yeah, and then whatever. Like I was still right there. My door trying to open it, and I seen that. The, I'm like, thank God the cop was in, like at the exit of the gate he was at the exit gate um with his lights on whatever and i'm like right here stuck with this damn dumb ass on my window so i was like what, what do i do my brother was like flash your highlights and and keep honking and honking until someone like responds to you until somebody hears something i was like all right so there i am honking and honking and um the cop i think he felt like he was like okay you know what like why is she hella honking and like why is someone hella honking and bringing the highlights and we trying to flash me down like um like you know like just to get their attention so that's what i did um he whatever i'm like, I'm like so i can't even talk right now because it's just so scary and, I, and i'm going back to the moment where it was like so scary so it's like hard but anyways um whatever that guy he had he had left because he saw the cops was there and so i was like you know how's getting their attention so he had like took off like he fucking ran so i went with the cop was i'm like hey i was like it's me that called I was like crying in shock i was like it's me that called like my baby's in the back seat i was like this freaking guy was just doing this to me he had a mask on he had black gloves on he had a blanket with him i was like and he just ran off i was like he was first he told me by my door at my apartments and then he followed me to my parking spot. He didn't let me back up. He didn't want to leave me alone. I, I called you guys. And he was like, okay, okay. He's like, just relax. He's like, I'm going to need you to grab the baby and go park yourself across the street to the other um, officer. So there's another officer across the street where um, he told me to go. And I was with the other cop. And he was just telling me, he's like, what's going on? And I told him the whole thing. And he was just like telling me, do you have problems with anybody? I was like, no, I don't. I was like, not that I know of. And he's like, have you ever seen this guy? I was like, no, I've never seen this guy before. I'm like, never. And he was like, okay, um. He was like, what was he wearing? I was like, he was wearing everything dark. And he had this, like, this, like, mascara on his face. And he was just like, what the fuck? Like, you know, like, shook. Like, what the hell was he trying to do? And he's like, so you sure you didn't cause any problems to anybody? I'm like, no, I, I have not. I'm like, not that I know. I was like, I don't know if people have problems with me. I'm pretty sure. Like, I have a lot of people that talk shit to me on Instagram. People that freaking just hate. I'm like, but not to the point where this, somebody would do this to me. And he's like, all right. So yeah he was I was, with the, I was with the officer and he was like all right we're gonna be in the area patrolling he's like we're gonna keep an eye out see if we see this person so yeah so they were in the area um so he so he was just in the area during around with other cops too and i had just left i was like let me i'm gonna get out of the area like my baby was already like 
upset, shaky. So I was like, let me just leave the area. So that's what I did. I um, I drove off. I was like, I'm not gonna be here, mate. I don't even. I was just so scared. I didn't want to be here no more. So I went to um, get something to eat for my brother. I was I went to my brother's house and I was like, trying to be relaxed, whatever. But man, that was so scary. Like if you're a mom out there and you're out in the dark, please be careful. Like grab your babies by their hand. Like don't leave your baby alone. Like don't even like. Trying to be out and in the dark alone because it's just so scary. You don't even know what people are freaking crazy. And the scary part, I don't even know this person. Like, I now I'm like, I could be seeing this guy in public. I can run into the guy at the store and I wouldn't even know that's him. And like, but he knows me. You know what I'm talking about? Because he had a mask, so I can't even like say, oh, I recognize him. That's a guy that hurt me. You know, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go do this to him. I'm gonna go get press charges. I can't because I don't even know who this person was. I don't. To this day, I don't know who he was. Which is so scary. And now I now I have to be like more alert when I'm out. Um, you know, like the person knows my car. The person knows where I live now. It's just fucking I like. Care. You're not even back. Yeah. Okay. I'm figuring how that fits before it gets dark. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. That's really good. So yeah, now I'm just like really scared. Like I'm scared. But my mom was like. We had to get you out of that area, my guess. So, like, I'm gonna find somewhere else to live. Like, I don't know if I should live, like, leave into another town or just to another place. I mean, because we're already secure. I mean, right here where I live, it's secure enough, like, they have gates and you can't, you can't just walk into my apartments. You can't just drive in here because of gates. So, it's like, it's good. But I don't know how this guy got in. It was just so scary. That's, what, that's the other thing that scares me to this day. It, like, it kills me and sound like, what if it's like somebody that's close by? Like, it's somebody that. Is watching me, like it's just scary. Like, it really is scary. Like, I'm not comfortable at all, and it sucks because, like, I don't know, like, I don't know who this person was, and it sucks. I don't know who he is. And I wish I wish I would have, like, seen a little bit of his face to be like, All right, I recognize him. I'm gonna, like, that's the guy I'm gonna go press charges now. So, yeah, like I said, I was like, You guys are out here with the babies, and you guys walk out somewhere at night, just be careful with other baby hand, and like. Run to your car, run back inside. Like, you don't know. Right now, it's so bad. But, yeah, so. <clears throat> Let me know if you guys um, went experienced something like this, like me, and what you guys did. Um, and how are, you, how are you feeling about it afterwards? It's been, what, two days now? And I'm still shook about it. Like, earlier, I was just, like, telling my sister, I was like, I don't even want to be out. I just want to be in my house, but I can't hide in my house. I have to go to work. I have to take my kids to school. Like, our life has to keep going on, you know? But now we're just, now I'm just more alert. Because I'm always like, if you see, if you just see me, I'm, I'm just straight to my car. No, I don't talk to nobody. Like, I don't be looking around. But now I'm going to be more alert, like, looking around who's around me, my babies. Um, oh, my nephew's crying. But now I'm going to be more alert now this time around. But, huh? Honestly, yeah. Unless I'm not to be out so late or in, not, not just that, but having my door open like that while one maybe ready to run out of my house, you know, having my shoes on and stuff. And yeah, so let me know what you guys uh if you guys went to something like this and what you guys did. Um how was your how did, was your experience? I know it's nothing, nothing cool to talk about, but it's just like it's just to sh like just like I'm making this video honestly just to show you guys like what really hap what happened and just so you guys can be more alert cautious. and be more cautious, cautious and careful. Um, but anyways, yeah, I'm gonna end my video here. So, if you guys have any questions or <laughs> my nephew's like wide awake. If you guys have any questions or um comments below or anything as well, or you guys want to ask me like. Anything else, just message me on my Instagram or send me a message through here. Alright guys, see you guys.